On March 21st, Prime Minister Ayurdin, accompanied by some members of the parliament as well as cabinet members, visited Bayung Utki Amak to become acquainted with works being carried out. The Prime Minister met with the local authorities to hear about the socio-economic situation and pressing issues in the Amak, and tasked corresponding officials to complete the tender process urgently, intensify investment works, ensure the preparation of medical checkups to be launched from May 1st, and actively participate in the Atar 4 campaign. Afterwards, Prime Minister Oyurdin presented the new revival policy to the citizens of Bayonetli Amak and heard their views. The meeting was attended by more than 400 citizens representing all sums of the AMIC. Citizens' suggestions were received on the project to develop the AMIC's socioeconomic situation and promote employment. Out of the citizens that were surveyed, 80% supported putting the Ashat silver deposit and non or sum of Bayoetli AMIC into economic circulation. Upon receiving the local suggestion, the Prime Minister tasked the corresponding officials to report on the issue being faced on putting the Assault Silver deposit into economic circulation at the Cabinet meeting. The government's new revival policy reflects certain issues, such as allowing Taranur border checkpoint to operate 24-7, ensuring the permanent operation of Taeng border checkpoint, as well as establishing a free economic zone. Prime Minister Ayurdin also instructed Minister of Road and Transport Development, Hatter, to commence the construction of auto roads near the Ahta Taumbag Mountain in 2023.